classic, the three broomsticks. Keep it simple, keep it easy. Peachy 
this year they keep going to the forest the dog wood why would they do that wait it was the lake this time that is terrifying okay well be careful if you go for a walk by the lake okay bring your wand so let that powder sit for a little bit I'm just gonna brush a little bit of it off for here too. Okay, now it's time for bronzer. I got super excited with the blush. I don't know why I went. I was gonna go gung ho with the brush. Blush. So this is a pretty shade. We're just gonna go in like that to your cheeks. That foundation shade might have been a little bit too. Thank you. 
Six, get the basics down. 
also add Lumos to any tattoo you would like. So if you would want a snake, I can make it. So if you say Lumos, the snake will light up. A very cool feature. So we also have a Hogwarts letter. Very cute and tiny and sentimental. Add little ribbons and I've also had people request their owl in the background, which I can do, of course. So take a look at those. If you see any you would like. Perfect. So I think I'm going to show you. I have three more pieces that are somewhat bigger. These are actually my favorite, kind of a crowd favorite as well. One of them is a new design though that no one has ever seen. So we have my favorite piece, which is the Felix Felicious or Liquid Luck. And it's in this tiny little vial and it has little glimmers and sparkles and a little tag that says Felix Felicious. Yes, a little liquid luck of your own, if you may. So there is this design. It has little ribbons and would look just wonderful. Let me think the correct placement for that. I just love the back of the ear. It's like a little secret tattoo. Back of the neck, on the hip, or even on the wrist right here. So just think about it. We also have a golden snitch. Potter. Of course he got that one. Just a tiny one. On the back of his neck, of course he did. But, yes, a little snitch with little star accents. Very cute, very cute. And last but not least, we have a wand. So, if you can, if you have your wand, I can do a custom tattoo based off of that. What type of what is it? So, I would do, probably for you, if you chose this tattoo, I would do different vines. Okay, probably for you, I would add different vines. Just kind of like this one around the wand. And then add a spell coming out of it. Really whimsical and just magical, you could say. Right, so those are some options. And then, of course, I don't know why I didn't put this on the other page, but we have a mischief managed to go along with the I solemnly swear I'm up to no good tattoo. So, those are the designs I have with any type of accents. My specialty are kind of these vines and little stars to make it whimsical, but I can try to do anything that you request. So, what are we thinking? Have you made your decision yet? Wonderful. I love that. And we'll add a different accent, right? Okay, you're thinking some vines, some stars, the little stipples that you saw. Okay, we can do that. Perfect. I love that. So, where are we putting the tattoo? Okay. So, I'm just going to cleanse the area. Even if it's magic, we still need to be sanitary. So, I'm going to take some moon water. It's very necessary. It also charges the area and makes it transfer a lot easier. I 
sick of doing potions class. Absolutely sick of it. I'm a wreck. If I didn't have a tutor in it, it would absolutely just be brutal.
Thank <laughs> you. 
actually where you got it. If someone's gonna find out, someone's gonna find out, but it can't come from your mouth, okay? I have my ways. I send out my little birdies. Let people know that I have a business. <laughs> Do not let a professor Siri see it. This is very important. Get it if someone sees it. Accidentally, or you know, some things happen, but it is imperative that no professors see it. So, use the proper incantation to hide it when you can't hide it with clothing. clothing. So, detrimental lapses, you can write that down if you want. No bragging or boasting, as I said before, it's just unappealing, unattractive. I don't want my work associated with. I told you about the lavender. Do you remember that? Yeah, so a little lavender should help do the trick. Moon water, that will especially help the healing process and any discomfort. And if for whatever reason the lumos and nox isn't working, just come back to me. I'll see what's up.
Your worth is not defined. Your worth is not defined. 